Um. Yes, let's use a rock smash. I'm pretty sure we can find some Pokemon from that too. Okay, but not in that one. Break it? Yeah, let's, what about... There's a couple of Pokemon we can find, so... And actually, there's some of the ones that we're looking for in... Even in the dark areas. We're going to take down everyone else so we can get what we want. Alright. See, so there's a couple trainers. This one's another two. Alright, so Gulpin, and the other one's Electrite. Interesting. Alright, well, we're gonna do the classic here. And considering we're overleveled, it's gonna be pretty easy. And honestly, we're not even overleveled because we fought, we're just overleveled because we catch so many things that, you know, we still get XP from catching. So we end up, you know, getting a lot of XP back in return here. to 11. You weren't supposed to beat me. Well, too bad. Alright, come on. Give me a Pokemon out of these rock smashes. There's Pokemon in here that we need. Let's go. Alright. Um, so, give me a uh, Dwebble. I'll take a Dwebble. Dwebble is my homie. I'm tempted to do a round, but let's just do a quick attack, because I don't feel like just... Okay, we can probably do a round here. Alright, increase your defense. That's actually not a bad thing at all. Um, that'll help me not kill you. Whew. Yeah, if it didn't do that defense crow, I would have killed it. So, um, mm, that's good luck. Thank you, Dwebble. I actually appreciate that. That helps quite a bit. Okay. Um, okay. So that's, that's the Dwebble. We're looking for a couple of other Pokemon. It makes a hole in a suitable rock. If that rock breaks, the Pokemon remains agitated until it locates a replacement. Jump from the ceiling. Zubat, that is another one that I need. I will take a Zubat. Um, I'm gonna get a little crazy here. I'm just gonna throw one Pokeball. Um, I have a feeling I'm gonna kill it with Quick Attack. Alright, maybe I'll just... I will throw another Quick Attack. Um, I don't think it's a good idea, but I'm gonna do it. I have an inkling that I'll kill it. Okay. So we wasted a ball, but that's not the biggest deal on the planet, to be honest. I just hope it stays in the first try. Let's go, Wubat. Thank you. Alright, Wubat was caught. Bloom in 19. Its habitat is dark forests and caves. It emits ultrasonic waves from its nose to learn about its surroundings. So, kind of like an off brand Zubat. But this one is psychic instead of poison. Alright, Rock Smash. Give me, um. Give me an Onyx, please. Nothing. Okay. We're Team Flare, we put a- we're looking for fossils. There are two members, well then, are you ready to team up and battle them? Yeah, why not? Let's do it. You're going to- Oh, we won't let you get away with it. Alright. Team Flare battle. 1-1? One, one. Alright. Shouldn't be a very hard fight. That Esper is a pretty cute Pokemon. Alright, let's go ahead and Water Pulse the Scraggy. And then that'll leave just the Crow Gunk. It survived? 
you butt cheek. Why? That hurt. Wow! Dude, they blasted that Esper. Holy! Alright. Well, it looks like she's got another Pokemon, but wow! Alright. No! Why would you attack that one? Attack the one! Attack the The Serena's on a whole nother level. Like, her battling is like... Okay, I'm just gonna risk it. Why would you do that? And I keep attacking it with the water, and as, I, as I'm making fun of Serena, I'm making fun of Serena, and I'm hitting the Krogunk with water. Oh no, are we gonna like lose, dude? All right, well, luckily, we actually have a few... We have quite a few capable Pokemon, so... Really not that big of a problem. Um... Yeah, that's fine. Let's go ahead and bite the Scraggy, because it doesn't seem like... Now, all of a sudden, she wants to hit the right person. Thank you, Serena. You only could have done that a while ago. All right, Loudred to 21. Venipede to 20. Chomp. Alright. Well, we should be able to kill it here. Pin Missile. Chomp, chomp. Alright, and we could probably hit it with a pound here. Alright, and a pound should... Yeah, there we go. Alright. Started off a little bad. Started off a little bad, but that's okay. My problem is, I don't think I have a Frogadier now, because I don't have a Revive with me. Go, go, Team Flare. Oh, I lost. I guess I'll stop cheering now. And we got a little bit of money for it. Oh, man, my favorite fashionable Team Flare suit is filthy. If we can restore fossils, we can make some good money. Okay, will you move out of my way? Okay, so here's... Okay, let's first do this. Onyx, please. Um, exactly what I needed. Literally exactly what I needed. Unless... Uh, unless one of those could do it. Yeah, that is literally what I needed. Thank you, game. Appreciate that. Right, can, Serena, can you maybe heal me? Okay, she can't heal me. I thought maybe the game would let me. Alright, come on. I need an Onyx. Alright. Let's go, dude. I'm really glad it's actually giving me some of the things that I need. Um... Let's go and around it. I know for a fact Quick Attack will not get it to yellow. Okay. That's fine. Alright, so it's gonna be a little bit of a hard catch. Um, but I definitely think it's doable. Hard catch, but doable. Okay. throwing some balls at it. One. Two. What? We might also have to throw a super potion on Frogadier so he doesn't die again. I only got 12 balls though. I'm starting to run out here. Please, Onyx, don't... Don't don't be that guy. All of your other friends have been so nice and staying in their balls. Just stay. One, two, three. Let's freaking go, dude. All right. 
There we go. Onyx. Burrows at high speed in search of food. The tunnels it leaves are used as homes for diglets. That is something that I did not know. That makes a lot of sense, though. Um, I actually, I don't think I need to use any more rock smashes because I found both Pokemon, the Dwebble and the Onyx. So really, I just need a Pharaoh Seed from that and something else. Okay, an escape rope. That's pretty good. And then also, before I forget, let me heal because Frogadier is pretty low. There we go. Did you find him? Why, hello. Here to look for fossils as well. Are you okay? Did Team Flare come here? Team Flare? What's that, a Pokemon? Don't worry about it. Looks like he was completely absorbed and looking for fossils. You two are very lucky. I just now found two fossils, but they're ones I already have, so I'll give one to each of you. Do you want the jaw fossil or the sail fossil? I want the jaw fossil. Um, is that? Yes, I do. Because that has Tyrant, and I like Tyrant. Well then, I'll take this one. I'll restore your fossils and turn them back into Pokemon at the Fossil Lab. Hope to see you there. Okay. Well, we went looking for the assistant, and we found the suspicious group called Team Flare as well. I guess I should train more so I could travel safely around with those Team Flare. In that case, I guess the best thing to do would be challenge the Silly Age City Gym. Okay. Well, we can definitely do that. Um, but I do need one of these encounters, and I need Pharaoh Seed, for favor. Not Pharaoh Seed. But I think it's a 50-50 chance, so we really shouldn't have to do too many encounters before we get it. Um, but just for luck purposes, so that's a 50%. Let's we're gonna keep counting down from there. So let's go in. Go back in, and let's keep running around until we hit that. Alright. 50%. 25%. Alright, we are currently at 25%. Um, I guess we can keep running the rest of the way. Because there should be a couple more drops along here somewhere. I don't know how long it takes for one of those drops to hit, but I guess we'll keep going in and out until we get it. Is there always a... There wasn't a drop there that time. I don't know where the drops are. Maybe I should... Maybe if I talk to Serena, it resets them? I don't know. Can I even find Pharaoh Seed in those encounters? I'm really trying to figure it out, because it doesn't seem like we can. No! We just got... Horrendously unlucky, and you know what's the funny part? I started keeping track of the percentages just because I knew I knew it would try to screw with me. I knew it would. Watch me accidentally kill it too. Okay, got into the yellow. Alright, so while we catch it, I'm gonna try to get the odds on that. So, let's see, 100. I try to open up a calculator. So, 100 divided by 2, that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Nine. Okay, and I think that's nine. So zero point nineteen, right? Zero point nineteen five. Zero point one nine five divided by. Wait. Zero point one nine. 
five divided by wait wait no 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 it's 100 divided by 0 0.195 so what happened to me will happen one in 512 which is just an interesting number 500 people and this would only happen to me and also I'm I don't know if that number is right. I'm, I think that's accurate. Pretty sure that's accurate. When threatened, it attacks by shooting a barrage of spikes. When gives it a chance to escape, it rolls away. But we're fine. We got the Pharaoh Seed out of the way. And honestly, I'm not even mad about the luck because I just know what's coming. So, like, I'm not mad you know i've prepared myself mentally that the game will screw with me it and it's really funny because again I've, I've, I've said in a prior thing i also do realize that i've gotten extremely lucky at other points too so it seems like the game is really odd and either gives me really really good luck or really really bad luck it doesn't really like to stay in the middle which is kind of funny to me. You know, I either get every single Pokemon that I need right on time, or I absolutely never get it, you know? Um, so we're gonna go ahead and do a couple more encounters for the Pokemon that we need. We only need a couple here. Um, we just need Soul Rock, Genghis Khan, and Mawile. So it's only three. It's not that many. The problem is... Um, those are all the pretty rarer spawns, which, you know, are a little harder to... Hel Hello? Very much confusion, yes. Alright, again, Solrock, Genghis Khan, or Mawile? Mawile, um, that is actually the really rare one, 2%, so yes, thank you. We will definitely take that. Um, I'm gonna go in and try to do a round, and this might be very dumb of me. No, okay. That was probably a little risky, but let's go ahead and stick in the luxury ball, too. I just want to see if maybe I can put in a luxury ball. One, two, no, Maw Wild didn't want to be in the luxury ball. That's all right. Let's stick in a normal Pokeball then. One. Bite. Chomp, chomp. All right, and of course it crits me. Alright, we only got eight balls left. We don't have much, so. Thank you, Mawile. You piece of crap. Why would I why did I thank you? I shouldn't have thanked you. It was a premature thanks. I take it back. I'm no longer thankful. One, two, three. I'm not thankful. Whoa. This small while is nuts. Absolutely nuts. I might need to go buy more balls. I don't I don't have any left. Oh dude! My Pokeball allowance is absolutely destroyed. I was actually doing pretty good hitting every single one with two. Dude, my allowance is gone. I'm not gonna have enough balls for Genghis Khan or Soul Rock. And Frogadier's gonna die. Oh, this is really, really bad, actually. Please, small while. Oh. I don't have any balls left now. That's kind of a problem. Okay, well, we at least got it. 
but that took a lot more balls than I wanted it to. It uses its docile looking face to lull falls into complacency, then bites with its huge, relentless claws. Alright, well, we got it. That's the important part. Um, so I'm gonna use a potion, and I'm out of potions too, so I don't- I can't take too much damage from here on out, basically. So now what we need the 5% Soul Rock and 4% Genghis Khan. Hey, that's the Soul Rock. So really, we're only gonna need Genghis Khan. The only problem is I don't know if I'll have enough balls for either of them. Right, let's go ahead and do a round, and again, I'm hoping this doesn't kill it. Okay, not even close to killing it. Fire Spin should really not hurt that much. But the problem is that's gonna hurt me a little bit every round. Let's do another round hit on it. Aw, oh, so close to red. So I think what we're gonna end up doing is... Um, let's switch out Pokemon. Let's go to Loudred. Wait. Oh no, because of the fire, it traps me. Alright. We have to just kind of hope here that it catches it. If not, we're going to be in some trouble. Oh, thank you. Oh, that helps so much. Soul Rock, you don't even know how much that actually helps. Alright, and Frogadier is 34. Alright. There we go. Solar energy is the source of its power, so it is strong during the daytime. When it spins, its body shines. Alright. I'm guessing we don't have any more potions, do we? <gasps> we have two more potions! Okay, we're fine. Alright. Alright, we're good. Hey, we're solid. Now, we just need the Genghis Khan, and we're all set. That's all we need, just the Genghis Khan. Um, and... Yeah, hold on. Glittering Cave. Okay. Once again, we just really need that Genghis Khan. And also... Okay, no, I don't want to go that way. Where did I come from? Okay. I, there's one item. There should be a Genghis Khanite somewhere around here that I still do need. So I gotta make sure I, I don't leave without it. Also, I'm just putting it out there. If I find the shiny Pokemon and I run out of balls, I will be um, horrendously sad. And I will for sure throw every single ball that I have at it. Very, very quickly, we just have to find a Genghis Khan inside of the Glittering Cave and then we can finally get out of here. Um, so yeah, let's go in. Again, uh, we're just going to skip to me finding the Genghis Khan because it's a 4% and it's not that easy to find. So let's get started here. Oh, oh, okay, here we go. Genghis Khan, that um, took 15 minutes. So, not that bad, 15 minutes. You could say it's bad for a single Pokemon. Um... But, like, yeah, if there's, like, 540 I gotta catch, times 15, divided by 60, 135 hours to catch all of them. Not bad. I'll take it. I'm gonna do another quick attack, and if you crit Frogadier, I'm gonna quit the game. Okay. Only in the yellow. I would like it to be in the red. But I don't dare hit it one more time, so... And this is what we got. So... We don't got many chances here. We have to really, like, pray up right now. That's really bad. Um, that is really bad. I don't have many more chances here. Alright. Come on. Oh, 
Um, please. Oh, thank you so much. I got so scared. All right, that is the last Pokemon that we have to get in the cave. And a lot of you might be wondering, why am I trying so hard for the single Genghis Khan? Um, this is actually the only place in the entire game um, that you can get a Genghis Khan. So I quite literally could not leave here until I got it. There is nowhere else in the game to get it. It raises its offspring in its belly pouch. It lets the baby out to play only when it feels safe. So, this was definitely like a must catch here. Now, I don't remember which end was which. Yes, okay. I actually did go the right way. Look at that. So, we can now go ahead and head back to basically where we were at before. Go ahead and grab this. And then we did catch all of the Pokemon that we needed from this area. So, we're basically good to go. Um, we can just kind of run from the things that are here. Unless, of course, I get, like, a shiny. And I... As much as I want a shiny, I actually don't want a shiny right now because I have no balls to catch it. So... Por favor, no shiny right now. Just give it to me in, like, five minutes when I have more balls. Now, another thing. There was an item over there that I totally neglected to go get. So let me run over and get that. All the way over here. Firestone. Alright. That's a pretty item. Okay. Let's go down, sideways. I wish I could like sprint with this Rhyhorn, but I know I at least the buttons that I'm pressing won't let me. Another yeah, sand dial. I definitely we gotta stop by the Pokemon Pokemon stuff. Pokemart? I know there used to be a Poke Center and a Pokemart. Now they're one thing. I don't know what they call it now. Is it still technically a Poke Center? I don't know, man. I, I don't know what the new kids call it nowadays. Um, okay, psych, I have to go back. Bonk. Bonk. Right, we're making our way downtown. Another encounter that we will run away from because I don't need you. Maybe I would have caught it if it was the other uh, sex of the hippopotamus. I know the female and male look different. Maybe I would have caught it if it was the different one, but probably still not. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, I'm not, okay. I'm not, nope, it looks like I'm gonna go right here. Pretty cool. Alright, well, that's that whole arc done. Now we gotta go to the fossil area. But first, we're gonna go straight to the Pokemon Center before I forget. And heal and buy more Pokeballs. And put away some Pokemon, too. Let's just put these away. Go ahead and heal these bad boys up. Thanks for waiting. Liddy. Okay. Deposit. We will go ahead and deposit Skiploom. Deposit Loudred. We will keep these other three. We gotta withdraw two more. Okay, I think I'm gonna grab the Gulpin, and I'm also going to grab the Talo. So those are the two Pokemon that we'll just keep on us gonna keep them handy and let's see how much money we got I'm hoping I have quite a bit 16k actually not as much as I thought we did we can go ahead and buy 30 more uh, normal pokeballs and then we could probably buy 10 more great balls we definitely need a couple more potions now so let's buy two of those and I can't buy okay and I can't buy revive Okay, let's buy a few more balls then. Let's buy a few more Pokeballs. Okay, eight more. All right, we should be good now. We should be good. Um, we That'll be enough for a little while. A very tiny little while. 